subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit that bell to receive notification of all our latest content. This is our final floor downboard and I've opted for this and this for my breakfast. And I think I'm going to enjoy it. So we've just come back to our cabin and found that our suitcases are out on the bed. Well, that's and really this, nice of them to do that for us. Yeah, and we've got all this stuff. So we've got a, a sail here for something. Clothes. Oh, clothes. We've got a, a letter here. Um, welcoming so, us to the Oceania Club. Club. And then we've got these two little badges here. That's to indicate our status, status level. level. And then we've got our gift or something so open it up Lindsay let's see open the got. box open the box take, oh no it's not virgin is it <laughs> take the money let's see what we got oh, oh what's that key? luggage tags luggage tags if you can get them out seriously leather leather of course you wouldn't oh, well, expect anything nice. less would you yeah so thank you very much Oceana yeah very nice so after starting some of the dreaded packing, we headed up to the top decks and took part in one of our favourite activities on board, shuffleboard. On board Oceana, they do seem to have different rules than on the other ships we play, but we still enjoy it as a pastime, and it's also an opportunity to win some more O points. As this was our first and only day at sea, one of the other things that we enjoy doing and we haven't been able to do before was to have a coffee and just enjoy staring at the wake view. We stayed on deck for a while, enjoying a few more drinks and enjoying the band that was playing. Then it was time for Lindsay and I to both try out another new activity, the beanbag toss. The idea was you throw the beanbags and try to get them into the hole and you get various points. After a quick lunch, our sporting activities continued when we shot off up to the golf course and had a round of golf. So we've just done our golf again. And what happened today, Lindsay? We drew. And who got a hole in one? What? Yeah, I know you did. It was cracking. Shall I say again? What? A hole in one. Hole in one. Again. Yeah, again. Ooh, again. You. I've had it yeah. more than once. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So what? I hit it twice in one round. So. I'm just going to show you now, look, I'll just bring you around and show you the sea, right? So the sea here now, we've just turned around and we're coming into the English Channel. So we're at the Bay of Biscay now. And look how glassy and flat and calm the sea is. It's absolutely beautiful. And look, just the sea on the ship. As we're getting towards the end of our cruise, all those empty sunbags. There's more people in the pool than I've ever seen before. It could be because it's a sea day. No queue at the ice cream bar. Complimentary. And just no queues anywhere. anywhere. No queues anywhere. Not at the moment. There and might be. There might be some queues for the prize giving. There might be, but it's something that we've noticed. It's sort of virtually queue free this ship, isn't it? Clueless. Clueless. As a, clueless. As opposed, as opposed to, to, me. to clueless. <laughs> <laughs> So anyway, so if you're enjoying our Oceana vlogs as much as we've enjoyed being on the ship, perhaps you'd like to consider subscribing to the channel. And if you really enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up because it helps us. If you hit the notification bell, you'll get told whenever we put up a new video. So just as a demonstration why Oceania is different, this is mid-afternoon on a very sunny day. And look at the amount of empty beds there are. It's incredible. Not just, not just in the shade. Not just in the shade and the sun. So a little bit of an update on our final day. <laughs> final sea day on Oceana. What's the matter? Nothing. Um, so all the way through this cruise, we've been winning 
points, haven't we, for like little sporty competitions and the quizzes, thanks to everybody else in the team. <laughs> um, and yeah, and here is our team. Just put them up on the screen now. So that's our team. Janet, Alan, Joe and Paul. We did have a few other sort of comings and goings when people were busy doing things, weren't they? Yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah, but not many. That was not our many. That was team. our real team, yeah, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. So we ended up with 113 O points, didn't we? Mm -hmm. And O points mean O prizes. O prizes, <laughs> yes. Not just a key ring or uh, a pen. What uh, did you get, Lindsay? I got a polo shirt. And and I got a polo shirt. Yes, and. And a golf towel as well. So yeah, really quite nice prizes, weren't yeah, they? Yeah, we they could have had a, we could have had a, a wind a windbreaker jacket yeah. and all sorts of things. Tote bags. The, the, all the merchandise is, is you know it's marked with Oceania, but it's really nice quality stuff. Yeah. Um. So yeah, we were very pleased with that. It's really. a nice, pleasant little surprise, really. Yeah. Because yeah. we didn't realise that the prizes would be like that. No. Uh, so yeah, that was good. Yeah. So so we've had to pack them, find somewhere packed, in the place to put them. Yeah, pack them. <laughs> yeah. So we're all packed now, aren't we? So yeah. it's what time is it now? About half past five? Ish. Yes. Man City are in the final of the Champions League tonight. So let's so hope I'll they, stay in the bar. So let's hope they put that on the television somewhere to watch. Really? Well, hopefully. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? Well, I think there's very little chance of it. Anyway, so we're off for a couple of drinks now, then dinner probably in the terrace cafe yeah. again. It's because it's uh, nice to go up there and, and pick up what you want. Yeah, and, and you can mix and match mix things. And that's all the different courses that they have yeah. up there, and it's, yeah, it's really quite pleasant. Quite um, unpleasant. Isn't yeah. It? yeah, and then back down for a final quiz. Yeah, uh, which is just for fun. Just for fun, because all the prizes have been given out, and I don't think there'll be any fun. Everybody will be after the kudos of winning again. <laughs> no, I think so. <laughs> and then uh, maybe a few more drinks. Never know. And then to bed and 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 out of the room at eight o'clock in the morning. I shall miss this room. It's a it's beautiful really room. Nice. It's very comfortable, comfortable, large. I mean, it's only an ocean view, but it's. It's a very nice ocean view. Mm -hmm. mm. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you later. We're in the um, Terrace Cafe again tonight, and uh, this is what we've chosen for our starters. I've got a selection of cheese and um, meats and some olives. Oh, yeah. Mm. Looks very nice. Mm. What are you drinking for dinner this evening, Lindsay? Um, I'm having Prosecco, and you're having Malbec. Yeah, I thought I'd just try a Malbec to make sure it's still okay after I enjoyed it so much last night. So Lindsay. So Lindsay, yes. It's the last night of the cruise. <laughs> yeah. And you're still trying new things. Well, yeah, because there's so many cocktails to try. So There's no, not hope in hell getting through all of them. Well, what are you trying now? This is um, an espresso teeny. A what? Espresso teeny. Espresso teeny. So yeah. it's a coffee thing. Yeah. What's those lumps in? Oh, coffee beans. Coffee beans. <laughs> what oh. did you think they were? Well, I didn't think we had rabbits on board. No, you don't like it. Um, it's not the best one I've had. So what does it taste of? Coffee, coffee. and gin. Alcohol. So it's just like an alcoholic yeah. cold cup of coffee. Yeah. You don't like cold coffee. No. So marks out of ten? For me personally? Yeah. One? Not good then. And I <laughs> I've got a Hendrix <laughs> with tonic. Lush. But the night was still young and so we did try some other drinks because we couldn't leave the ship on a bad taste, could we? And after those drinks, I started feeling a bit romantic, so I dragged Lindsay up to the top deck of the ship so we could see the sun setting. We've arrived safely back into Southampton, and when we got back to our cabin last night, what did we discover? 
we discovered that we won the prize draw for filling in the um, review of the ship and we got a hundred dollars on board credit so thank you very much Oceana so it's just time to say goodbye to our beautiful ocean view cabin that is absolutely lovely and has served as well and to this lovely ship and all the beautiful staff that are on here as well.